Unique Bedroom Closet Solutions Dreaming of a cozy nook where you can curl up with a good book and read in comfort? Then you'll love this adorable book nook designed by Susan J. Design. It's a wonderful solution for an odd-sized bedroom closet in a guest room or kids have flown the nest extra bedroom. Not only does the built-in library provide a comfortable place to read and a home for your favorite books, but it also gives you extra storage for other items in the drawers beneath the cushions. Need somewhere to store an extensive collection of jewelry or beauty supplies? Or just want to show off your storage smarts? Then why not take a page from Emily Keller at EAK? a house, and turn a ho-hum cheap storage unit into something unique. While most of the shelves do regular duty holding shoes and other accessories, the middle shelf is backed with wine bottle corks. Just glue them into place, then add decorative hooks or nails as needed to hold necklaces, rings, and bracelets. Give your jewelry box a spot of honor in the middle, and now you have a storage spot worthy of your bling. You know the basics of a mudroom, a spot to hold dirty shoes, hang up book bags and purses, and sit to tug shoes on or off. Well, there's no law that says such a room is only suited for a home's back entrance, in fact, it's a great addition to a bedroom. Just turn that odd nook or tiny closet into a dressing space closet that serves a similar purpose to a mudroom, only without the mud. Check out the cute design by Wendy Hyde at Shabby Nest, it has everything you need for a mini dressing room. Sit on the comfy cushion to put on your shoes and socks, hang your purses, belts or hats on the convenient hooks, and store your laundry hamper underneath the seat. Genius! It is always nice to have a place to wrap gifts, especially during the holidays. Best of all, it's wonderful to be able to find wrapping paper, gift bags, and bows when you need them. So why not turn that extra closet space or odd-sized nook into a gift wrapping station? The super-organized wrapping paper center shown here was featured in the Southern Living Idea House in Sonoy, Georgia, and photographed by Susan of Between Naps on the Porch. Even if you don't go quite so elaborate, there are lots of good ideas here. If you have a lot of files, important papers, or magazines, you might want to create a similar storage area to the one shown here. Just position a baker's rack or similar shelving unit in your nook or small closet, add a selection of pretty boxes or baskets, and voila! You have an easy organizer for your papers and magazines. If you have a big enough closet that backs up to a bathroom, consider converting it into a laundry room. It's a great solution for a guesthouse, or any home that doesn't have a full laundry room. You'll likely need a plumber for this remodel, however. You do not have to use a full-size washer and dryer, instead, a nice stackable set along with smart storage solutions, such as this hanging wall rack and containers from the container store, will create a nice, functional laundry closet. Another great use for a small closet or odd nook is to transform it into a workspace. This can be as simple as adding a sturdy shelf with metal support brackets around 28 to 30 inches from the floor, depending on the height of the person using the space, to create a desk, painting or wallpapering the space, and then adding a chair, light and various organizers to suit your purposes. There are many types of workspace, a small home office, child's craft area as shown in the example here, homework center in a teen's bedroom or a computer desk. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more interesting videos and please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm.